Okay, dear students, let us see this question. An object is sliding from rest down a frictionless inclined plane. The object slides one meter during the first second. Okay, so there is an object that is sliding an inclined plane and there is no friction. There are no dissipative forces. So it is obviously the body will start inclining under the effect of gravity. Now, it is given that in first second, like in one second, it is traveling one meter distance. What distance will the object slide during the next second? So two seconds have been spent, but the question is not that what is the total distance in two seconds. No, the question is what is the distance traveled in next second. So what can we do here now? So let us uh, first of all find uh, the total distance. What we do is uh, we will find the total distance that was traveled in two seconds. Let us say it reached this point after two seconds have been exhausted, but in one second it has reached only this. So we want to find this distance, the distance traveled in the next second. So we will subtract S1 from S2. So our answer will be S2 minus S1. And S1 is given as 1 meter. And for that sake, we need to find S2. Okay, so things become simple now. S2 is UT plus half AT square. But... Uh, we do not know, okay, U can be taken as zero, but we do not know acceleration. So from the first set of data, we have to find the acceleration. Okay, so S1 is equal to UT plus half AT square. U in that case will also be equal to zero. And S is given as one meter, half acceleration is unknown, and the time spent is also one. From this, I can say that the body is accelerated at 2 meter per second squared and the acceleration will be g sine theta you know it yes this if this is theta it can be taken as g sine theta just telling you for the sake of information has nothing to do with this question okay so a is 2 and now we are going to substitute this thing here and the time is also 2 so the distance is coming out to be 4 meter so the total distance is now 4 meter this distance is 1 meter and they are asking what is the distance traveled in the next second obviously it will be 4 minus 1 and our answer will be 3 so this is how we do this question dear students so this is professor Varun. please subscribe to the youtube channel and share the youtube channel with all your friends okay then all the best bye